hello guys welcome back to coding cafe my name is Mohammed Ali and in this video we will talk all about and we will learn all about methods in C sharp and we will uh, also uh, learn about the types of methods in C sharp and we will discuss the benefits of using methods now first of all what is method so method is basically uh, a combination or collection or you can say a sequence of some lines of code that, that performs a specific task and now uh, let's create a project and we can talk about it further so let's call this as method okay visual c sharp console.net framework and the, uh, the name of our project and press ok and our project method is created successfully so now uh, basically method has two types the first one is method with return type which will return any value and the second one is the method with no return type which will return no value so first we will discuss and implement the method with no return type and then we will discuss the other method which is with return type so as you can see that this is our uh, main function and this is the default class program so first uh, let's create a method with no return type so we can say public void let's give it this a name multiplication and when we write uh, this void this void basically means that this method has no return type okay so that's why we write here this void and now inside here we can create a double data type variable let's say the first one is num1 let's initialize with 10 comma num2 equals to 2 and now let's create a variable call result which will store the multiplication of these two values so we can say result equals to num1 multiply num2 and now we have to display this result on screen so we can say console dot write line and we can say multi multiplication results equals to this concatenation sign which is plus and then result so this is all about the a method with no return type which is not returning any value now once we create this method then we have to call it as we know that c sharp is basically an advanced object oriented programming language so in c sharp there are two ways for calling the method okay so let's discuss the first one let me first tell you that is if we uh, call this uh, multiplication method here directly then we can't access that method here directly okay we will get error okay you can see that if you do it uh, in other programming languages then maybe uh, you get no error like in c++ c language but since we know that uh, that is c sharp is an advanced uh, object oriented programming language so there are two different ways to call uh, a method okay so the first one is just to uh, write here static 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 and you can see the error is gone successfully now if i press ctrl f5 and i run the program then you can see multiplication results equals to 20 so this is basically the first way the first way to display the uh, to call the method okay the first way to call the method in C sharp programming language is to write here uh, static with that method with no return type okay if we write static here then we can directly call that method in our main function directly now the second way to uh, call a method in C sharp programming language is to create an object of this default class which is program okay so first we have to uh, create object of this class so how we can create object of this class so we all we need is to write the class name which is program and then we have to give it any object name so let's say i'm going to name it as obj1 which is object1 equals to 
new and then again the class name which is program and these two braces and now to call this multiplication method we have to use this object one so by using this obj1 we can call that method and you can see the error is gone successfully so this is the second way to call a method uh, in c sharp programming language so let press ctrl f5 and you can see multiplication results equals to 20. now let's discuss about the methods with return type so first of all remove this okay and now uh, control x cut this code from here and remove all this okay so now we are going to discuss the methods with return type which will return value and the second thing is so what we did here first we get two values i mean the first one is initialized with 10 and the second one is with 2 and then we create a variable result okay now what we're gonna do all we need is to pass this num1 and num2 to this method which is multiplication so we can say num1 comma num2 and this method will receive this 10 and 2 values from the main function so here we can say double since it is double data type okay so we can call it as the same name like it is num1 and the second one is double num2 okay so it will receive these two values from there and make sure to change this void okay and the return type of this method will be double since we are using variables uh, as uh, double of double data type okay so now this method will basically perform the multiplication of these two numbers and it will return the result so we can say a return num1 multiply num2 and here in our main function we can say result equals to this and then we have to display the result so we can say console let me write it then i will explain it again okay console dot write line and we can say multi multiplication result equals to use this concatenation sign and result so now what we did here let me tell you that is we initialize these two values num1 with 10 and num2 with 2 okay and then we create a variable uh, result so we create uh, we basically create an object of the class since you know that in c sharp we have to uh, create a class or to use a static keyword to access or to call a method so just for the sake to access this multiplication method inside here our main function we create this object by the name obj1 and then we are basically calling that multiplication method and we are passing these two values okay num1 and num2 which store this 10 and 2 value so this method is called and it pass these values here which is 10 and 2 so here it will perform the multiplication which is 10 multiplied 2 and it will becomes 20 and it will return 20 here okay so it will return 20 to this back and it will store this 20 answer here in this result and then we display that result to the user so let press ctrl f5 and you can see multiplication results equals to 20 now by applying the other way uh, i mean without uh, creating this object we can also access this so we can remove this object from here and now here we can say public static double and you can see the error is gone and now this is the second way to call an object in c sharp now if i run the program then you can say c multiplication results equals to 20. so in this video tutorial you have successfully learned about what are methods what are the benefits of using methods and what are the types of methods that is the uh, method with return type and methods with no return type and also you access about the two ways in c sharp that how we can access or we can call methods in c sharp okay so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel coding cafe thumbs up for this video and if you, you have any confusion then let me know in the comment section down below see you guys in next video bye for now